Hey everyone, welcome to Watch It Paint It. In this video, we're going to be watching me unbox this cup of tea into my mouth. But aside from that, it's that time of month again. Here we go. It is Modelbox. If you're not aware of what Modelbox is, it's a monthly subscription similar to Loot Crate with model related items. I will put a link in the description below so you can check out the first one I did where I explain the subscription y stuff a little bit more. Now, as always, this arrived at sort of nine o'clock this morning. I don't get to open it for 12 hours to do this unboxing. And it sat on my desk, you know, going, hey, Ben, Ben, touch me, open me. I'm like, nah, model box, chilled your beans, mate. And I managed to resist. And then, you know what happened? Two hours passed. And then I remembered what the theme was. Hello, it is horror. So, you know, it's Halloween now. And if you don't know and are unfamiliar, but I really like zombie side. So I'm thinking, you know, zombie stuff. Another thing I noticed, it was ridiculously light this is the lightest one they've sent so hopefully that doesn't mean there's not much in it and hopefully it's just ghosts right they wouldn't weigh much and that would fit really well with the theme we're going to find out in a second there is another rocks the model box fox uh what would you call it unique bespoke custom it's only for model box these guys are in here and if you saw me talk about this before one of my favorite sculpts painted this up use it in zombie side so there's going to be a horror version of that in here and we'll find out what it is soon. I'm hoping it's more fantasy based than, um, you know, than the modern era stuff. So we will find out shortly. And bad news for model box is I am super excited about this one, unless you, in case you couldn't tell, genuinely very, very excited for the theme this month. The fact that there's a, a rocks in here, the theme's great. Let's find out what's in it, but you know, all that really happens with much hype comes great fall, but will it live up to it? Are you ready guys? Let's see what we get. Starting off, and I'll just casually not look at this. Oh, they've done the competition winner again though, I can't help but but notice. That was a really, really cool, I don't know if you can quite see that. It's hard to see in person. Need a bit more space, there's less congratulations, more picture. Everyone I think would love to see, what's this? You are Johnny, Johnny, don't know how you pronounce that. Apologies, I've just butchered your name, but we'll look at that in. Well, I'll look at it probably off camera, fill you in. I like the surprise, I don't like looking at the leaflet first, but let's see what we got. We got two more in star, they're doing a lot of these safety lids. These are yellow lids, I wonder why they're yellow. I don't think they were before, but this is carbonate red. Is that how you say it? Cabinet red? Cabinet <laughs> cabinet red. It's cabinet red and marine blue. Ooh, hang on a minute. These are, they look like metallics. Yes. I don't know if that shows up on camera a little bit. These are glittery. Ooh. So I've got some colored metallics. I, I can try these out sort of against Vallejo's uh, metal medium. So we could see if mixing your own is better. The, I mean, these look, that looks so sparkly. Super excited to try those. So two colored metallic paints. I do not own any colored metallic paints, so I would not own one if it didn't come with model box. Standard Harry Bow in here. These are yummy. Sophie will appreciate these because I'd run out because Benson eats most of my sweets, but let's carry on. Some packaging. This has next to no monetary value. I will be using this sort of stuff to send out any things that I send out on the channel as um, James will have noticed, put a bit of that in his box, make it look a little bit fancy. So so there's not much in this box this month. That looks a little bit light, doesn't it? Let's see what we've got. We've got a one inch, I guess that is, measurement sort of square ruler. It's really cool. Custom model box one. I do not play any skirmish games, so not even 100% sure what that's for, what do you do? Measure that it's an inch away. Movement, I don't know what this cutout's for. Somebody let us know in the comments below. I'm sure that is that shape for a very specific reason. Yeah, uh, somebody can let us know what that's for. So that's useful if you know what it's for, I guess. Not useful for me, unfortunately. And there's only two models, but at least one of them is the model box Fox. So. Let's have a look. This is the limited edition miniature number 196. Wow, so close to a cool number. Could have been 200. Uh, Dream Assassin. Oh, wow. Okay, that, that's really nice. Can I show it you without opening? It's like Freddy. Oh, I'm, right. 
Uh, I don't want. I never want to open it when it's like limited edition, but it looks really good, and I don't want the light to reflect on it and ruin your view of it. See if I can do better without opening it. Stop it, light. That's not too bad, is it? It's not that good either. Come on, Ben. You can do better. Right, we're opening. Sorry, guys. It has to be done because it does look dead good, and there's not that much to look at this month. So we may as well pop this one out. It's weird there's so few things in, in this box. There's normally tons of stuff, isn't there? Tons of content. I did say it was light. I was hoping it's full of ghosts, as I mentioned, but no, I'm not missing anything. So look at this, though. Freddy, Freddy Krueger-esque. Never even seen those movies, you know, but I think it's a very, um, what's the word? What is the word? I don't know. It's big, right? It, culture. Very, very cool. Big following. I mean, that just looks great anyway. Like, I work in a lot of games. It's, as I mentioned, it doesn't look like it's got any modern stuff, although it is relatively modern. It's very, very fancy, isn't it? I can use that in Zombie Side, no problem. So, that's right, good. So, they do a competition. I didn't mention, well, you saw on the leaflet, and this, this or the, the fox may well be in the competition. So, I guess we've got a choice. And then the, the only other thing in here is the second sculpt. This is, uh, it doesn't say, but it's, you know, uh, exclusive. That's the word I'm always looking for. So this is the, this is the model box, Fox Rocks. Let's have a look. Let's see what this one looks like. What have we got? I can't tell what that is. Whoa. Is that like a, an alien chest? Popper? Bursting out of his chest. Look at that. Aliens. Homage, I believe. That's what it certainly looks like to me. With the model box logo on the back. Can you see that? That is super cool. Love the tail again. Love foxes. I don't know why I didn't notice before I started doing the model box stuff how much I like painting foxes. But that is awesome. And I'm I mean someone's gonna correct me if I'm wrong, but I pretty I'm pretty sure that is a, a, a chest alien bursting out. So wow, absolutely amazing. So Guys, that's that's it though. These two models, two metallic paints, absolutely awesome. A ruler, I don't even know what's for, but it's all right, right? Like somebody's going to be getting this from the channel. <laughs> uh, some Haribo that I will eat. Um, just a, just not much content. Let's flick through this because it's not going to take me long, is it? Oh, it's going to explain what it's for here. We've got the Instar paint, new metallic. So this is their new range, I guess. Yeah. These colors are not technically out yet, so no, nobody's even seen them yet. That's cool. Uh, model box combat gauge for October. So this is to do with well, last year's October. We've been asking for this to come back, so they're back. It's not exactly horror movie themed, but definitely something your friends and opponent would be envious of. I mean, it does. It is thick and it is pretty cool. I just don't play skirmish games. Wow, wow, wow. Tells you about this. Uh, the winning from the competition last month so these will be competition this month and they are very very cool it is a chest burster i was right i, I, I forget this is here to explain it all but amazing absolutely love it now i don't know which one i like more this nightmare assassin no it's called the nightmare assassin it's freddy krueger right but that is pretty cool as well i'll be making some custom art cards for this so i can play this in zombie side but that's it um so this is a weird box for me. This is absolutely amazing. There's just not much to it. Compared to other months, it doesn't feel like you're getting a huge amount of value, even though, like, th these ain't going to be cheap. You know, if you were buying these individually in a shop, they're going to be, what, and I don't know, I don't buy individual models, but it could be 10 bucks each, right? Even if they're not, you know, this is worth $20, I guess, 20 pounds in the UK. It's not bad value. It just feels weird because there's less content but it's nice there's nothing in here other than the ruler which somebody will use benson plays skirmish games so that's fine for him all of this is 100 percent going to be used it's non this is cool but i'm not going to use it at least this box as little as it feels like there's in there bloody hell yes i'm going to be using these like straight away i want to go and find something i need to paint metallic red some metallic blue some fire and ice style characters I feel like I can't use these paints on these. I'm not sure if I'd use those metallics on any of this, but 
both these sculpts are, are lovely too. So that's pretty cool. It's probably weirdly the least content in a box, I feel, but the one I like the most so far. Can't wait to see what next month is. Let me know in the comments below what you thought of this box. And thank you all very much for watching.